Hello friends and followers. This is all new Samsung 980 1TB SSD. Samsung claims this to be the third generation fastest SSD with up to 3.5 GB per second transfer speed. Let's unbox and install on my latest Dell 5406 laptop and find out if it's really fast. On top we get the SSD and underneath it's the user manual. Samsung did not provide screw to lock the SSD and it comes with 5 years of warranty. This is 3rd generation NVMe M.2 SSD and can be installed on any PCIe Express slot. The size of this SSD is 2280 which is the biggest size in M.2 SSD category. This SSD has got transfer speed of 3500 MB read and 3000 MB write speed. There is also pro version of this SSD which uses 4th generation technology which can provide speed up to 7 GB per second, making it the fastest SSD till now. So 980 Pro is useful in laptops or PCs having very high specifications and mainly used for gamings. Let's install this SSD in my laptop. Every laptop has got different internal layout. So this video is for Dell 5406 i7 processor. All these upgrades are not easy, so do at your own risk. Under this metal shield is my SSD. So let's remove it. This is the smallest M.2 SSD, size of it is 2230. This is 512 GB SSD and today we will install 1 TB Samsung 980 SSD. Here is a short comparison between 2230 and 2280 SSD. 2230 being smallest and 2280 being largest. Now size of SSD has got nothing to do with speed. My pre-installed 512 GB SSD is giving me almost 2.8 GB per second read speed and 2.3 GB per second write speed. I am upgrading this because of storage, not because of speed.
Now this 980 is using latest 2.0 Turbo Ride technology, which is 5.5 times faster than any other M.2 SSD except 980 Pro. 980 is even faster than 970 Evo because of its 2.0 Turbo Ride technology. This SSD can run for long period of time at a constant high speed which is not in the case of 970 EVO. Here you can see the demonstration in graph form showing the write speed of 980 in blue and 970 EVO in orange. As you can see the 980 can transfer high speed data for long period of time without any heating issues unlike 970 EVO. This is real test using Crystal Disk Mark application and as per this application we can get 3.1 GB per second read speed and 2.3 GB write speed and there is no drop in the entire transfer process. These speeds are normal because Samsung claims it to be 3.5 GB per second which is ideal speed and due to many different factors it is not possible to achieve that speed in real life but still getting 3.1 to 3.2 GB per second is a very good transfer speed. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did then please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon. Thank you for watching.